gonna break for the surprise episode involving our new co-hosters. What? Uh, tasty? Mm, sweet? And colorful. Delicious. Um, colorful. And you can't regret. Colorful. Um, usually it was very hot, not like spicy, but just like temperature wise. Um, and I have to go, I have to go with delicious. It's kind of generic, but I, <laughs> I did enjoy it. I do like foods. The Italians and Ukrainians. Mm. Eat a lot of beef. <laughs> oh, we both like uh, fresh, uh, fresh stuff like tomatoes, cucumbers. So when I think about salads, mm, potatoes, we eat a lot. As you, we both like meat. Oh, wow. um. Yeah, and cheese. Actually, yes, Ukrainian cheese is um, more or less. Like ours, I think so, like in Germany. Here in America, we might just borrow a lot of our food, so. <laughs> yeah. I felt like Ukrainian food really kind of stood on its own. Um, it had, I mean, of course there were some similarities, but I can't really think of anything off the top of my head that was incredibly, you know, similar side by side. Ukrainians eat a lot. <laughs> and they always invite you to eat and if you don't eat everything, they think that you didn't like it. Very impressive, uh, all the courses. I mean, you start with like a first course, there's a soup, and so together with bread, this is something that what we do not have in common. So, uh, and after the first course, maybe another salad, and you feel, okay, no, it's good, it was so nice, thank you for the meal, and then, oh, what, what are you talking about? Oh, you eat a lot of bread also. I remember uh, being to Western Ukraine, and we've been to some breweries, they made their own beer, and this was very, really delicious. I didn't expect it. I was there for work, and so it was a lot of conferences, a lot of busy, busy stuff, but at the same time, we would always sit down and have meals together, and I really, really liked that. I really like borscht <laughs> because it's colorful. <laughs> it's, you know, it has this red color, so it involves you to eat it because it's very strange. The color of borscht made you Reminds you, uh, yeah, I wouldn't say blood. And when you try it, it, it has a taste, very um, good taste of beetroot, of course. A mixture of textures and tasty. Cherry filled like a little pasta pocket. And when I had it, it had some type of cream on top that was just, it was incredible. I'm not sure what type of cream it was, but it really like sealed all the flavors together and it was like every type of flavor you could imagine kind of all rolled into one delicious bite. <laughs> okay, uh, I don't know the name. I think it's meat with jelly. Oh goodness, um, I'm gonna say that I don't think I've had this one. It looks like some type of like gelatin congealed chicken maybe. I don't. I know it's hol hol uh, hol yet. I never tried it because I don't like this glibbery thing around. <laughs> but I like the meat inside. Uh, oh, yeah, I know. Oh, I love them. Uh, oh, pilmeni. Oh, I like it very much. <gasps> Is that the Vareniki? Oi, 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 oi. It's um. It's uh, Vareniki. I tried them in uh, when I was in Lviv, and they were oh amazing, very very. I I really like them. <laughs> uh, nope. It looks like some sort of like leaf wrap. Like, is it a cabbage leaf of some sort? Uh, Galupci. I like this because in Germany we have the same like like Galupci, but they are bigger. And here we have the small things, and I always think, oh God, 
These are really hard working people who in the kitchen who prepare the small things and they roll it and they do it and they prepare everything so that it fits to you and you just come and eat and so on. Ow. No. Compote. Yes, this juice. It's a type of, I drank it. I don't remember what it is though. It has a very distinct flavor. Uswar. Yes, 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 yes. Uswar. 20. As many as many cooks in Ukraine, as many recipes exist in Ukraine, I think. Let's say 100,000. That's a lot. <laughs> See, you can choose which ingredients, food and mixture. But I know it's very hard to cook. It takes a lot of time, long hours to prepare. So I never tried it on my own. K Y I V. Perfect. I'm having, okay, I'm trying to make sure. I'm having like flashbacks of like the American spelling in my head. I'm going to go with K-Y-I-V. It's very difficult because we, we spell it like K-I-E-V, but I know it's in English K-Y-I-V.